measuring 5.7 inches and boasting an impressive 2880 x 1,440 pixel resolution, the G6 has envious screen specs, but those cool rounded edges and the overall size of the G6S screen isn't what makes it so special. It's the 18,9 aspect ratio. This also equates to a 2,1 ratio, which means two perfect squares fit next to each other on it, something that LG exploits in the user interface. Why should you care about the aspect ratio? Isn't that sort of thing just for cinegeeks? It's actually the movie industry that may end up making or breaking the 18,9 screen. Some filmmakers consider it to be the happy medium between cinema and TV aspect ratios, meaning regardless of what screen a video is watched on, it will retain the same look no cropping to fit and stay the same as the director and cinematographer intended. More and more video is being watched on smartphones, so this is a major consideration. For now, there's a limited amount of 18,9 content online, mostly streamed through Netflix. We watched Daredevil and Marco Polo on the G6, and both looked superb, filling the screen entirely after tapping a special button in a drop-down menu. There's something very special about seeing a video fill the screen this way. It's more immersive, more cinematic, and genuinely impactful. The aspect ratio isn't the only feature that makes the video experience on the G6 special. It's the first phone to come with both Dolby Vision and HDR10 support. This technology previously only seen on televisions is designed to make the image more lifelike with better colors, more accurate contrast levels, and wider viewing angles. There's not much content out there that takes advantage of it at the moment it doesn't make any difference to regular YouTube videos, or the operating system so it's only Netflix or Amazon Prime subscribers that may see the benefit. There's also the problem with video content that's not formatted for an 18,9 screen. That content has black bars running down the sides of the video in landscape orientation. If 18,9 video catches on like LG and others hope, this will eventually become less of a problem, but for now, you'll have to put up with them in most cases. Size oddities aside, the G6S display is stunning. It's full of color, detail, and warmth, and a true pleasure to watch. Although the screen is technically 5.7 inches in size, it doesn't really look like any other 5.7 inch screen, and some may see the G6S screen size as a con, due to the taller, thinner aspect ratio. For example, put the G6 alongside the 5.5 inch iPhone 7 Plus and open an app such as Twitter, and the iPhone will display more text and information on one screen than the G6. It's still a big screen experience, just unlike those we're used to,